Hello friends, I'm sorry I've taken such a long time to do a blog and update you all with what's been going on, but let me just tell you briefly what's, what's happened. I've been very busy here looking for a new flat and things like that, so let me just tell you. The state of alarm finished on Sunday all across the Canary Islands and uh, of various places in the mainland and the new normality began and new normality basically means it's not normal yet <laughs> but new normality sounds nice and safe so we'll just call it that that's my explanation <laughs> things are normal if you think that wearing a mask in the street is normal <laughs> sorry I'm being a little bit naughty about it I'm just in one of those sorts of moods and anyway this is just a blog don't take everything so seriously bloody hell right so new normality began on Sunday and also as people have been waiting and hoping and all sorts of strange stories have been going around especially on the UK forums uh, but basically um, tourists are allowed to come back in on Sunday the Sunday just gone tourists are coming in from the UK Quarantine is still in place to return back to UK. We don't know when that's going to be dropped yet. But there are your, everybody is very free to come in and enjoy Tenerife. So that's all wonderful. Nightclubs are open, but you can't dance. So um, you just have to sort of stand around gormlessly, sucking your thumb. What else? Cafes and restaurants and everything are all... All restrictions, uh, restrictions have been lifted. Uh, the thing is, things aren't back to normal of course not because of restrictions but because of the fact that there's nobody here well anyway as a person who's already living here um, I am already booking my flight to go back to the UK don't know for how long yet uh, I'm expecting that I'm gonna have to go into quarantine when I go over there in July well I'm going in July so maybe by then they would have um, uh, dropped that dropped that policy what else is new? I've been in the countryside today. Pick, sometimes you come across picnic areas that are still sort of cordoned off, but I don't think, as far as I know, that every free to roam anywhere nowadays. <laughs> nowadays. Uh, so I think they've actually just forgotten to take down the cordon. But I'm not recommending that you take them down to yourself. Don't want to be liable for anything. Even if that's what I do, I just climb over them myself. <laughs> Um, there's going to be a part two to this video, which I will try and somehow, with my magical technical skills, make it appear right round about here, the part two. And that's just a little thing that I want to have a chat to you about. Some kind of bridging consultation service between the UK and Tenerife for those people who are wanting to come and live here or retire here and things like that so if you're interested in that kind of thing please have a look at the next video and I'll just tell you about my ideas so that you can give feedback and tell me what you think about it all right um, it's rather windy I hope you've been able to hear what I've been saying it's gonna be really annoying if I have to record the whole thing all over again because I've got an annoying windy sound going on I'll see you all soon my dear friends comment and like subscribe please I don't think I've ever done that before I think the very fact that I've never asked anybody to sub subscribe before is the very reason why you should subscribe right now. Ding! <laughs> See you all soon.